taking trips out to the beach and want to be comfortable. Um, I like to be comfortable. I'm a big guy, 6'2", 220. My wife's a little bit smaller. So we're going to check them out, see which ones we like the best for ourselves. All right, guys. Uh, the chair uh, I'm going to be testing out is the real gear. It says capture the spirit. Uh, it's a pretty cool looking chair. It has a cooler pouch on the back for your drinks. It has another little bag here. We're going to see the ease of opening it up right now. Let's see if I can figure it out. I'm not the sharpest crown in the box, but yeah, hey. Other way, you need to unlock it first. Uh, here. Well, I think something. Here, please, beautiful wife. This is my assistant, Lily, right here. It's going to help me out. <laughs> All right, so there is a uh, little lash my husband couldn't figure out. <laughs> I missed that. And you literally just unhook. Then after you unhook, we'll do it together. That's why she takes care of me. And then this bottom part, you have to push out. So it's a little bit easier than I made it out to be. This looks like it definitely won't fit me. So we can adjust it like that. How does it feel? I'm gonna sit. Feels pretty good. Pretty comfortable. It actually uh, feels better than I thought just by looking at it. Um, Let me test it. Wipe and test it. Oh, it's sturdier than you would think for sure. What I like about this one is you can recline all the way. And it has a headrest. Well, and a cup holder. So. Yes, this one has a cup holder and there are different levels of um, relaxation as far as uh, reclining. Um, what I also like about this one, I noticed there is a small bag here for your uh, keys or whatnot. And then there's a cooler pouch down here to keep something cold. Your beverage is cold. Oh, and also has these like straps that. and you can convenient because you can carry it as a backpack in your bag. So I like that one a lot. Yes, this one cool. I really like. I don't know about this one. Alright, you want to test this one? Alright. Alright guys, this is Ned's chair, also by Rio. Uh, this one has a shoulder strap instead of the back strap. This depends on your preference, what you like. It's pretty easy to open up. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> we'll see how it goes. Are you laughing in it? There we go. Alright. So this one does recline. Uh, it feels a little bit more comfortable to me because uh, it's a bigger chair, has a taller back. Uh, but it does have a shallow cup holder. Things might tip out if you like a little bit deeper. Uh, but it also has this uh, convenient little space for your cell phone right here. It has a bag for uh, extra keepsakes and whatnot. And I'll let my wife take a seat. She can adjust it probably better than I can. So this is a high beach high chair, beach. 17 yeah, inch. Chair. This is for the big guys. So it does recline very easily, very simple. Um, the difference, I like this, this feels good. But the difference between this one and this one, the other Rio, is that this does not recline all the way back. So if you're looking for that, um, if you're looking to recline all the way back, this would not be the chair. But I do like how that has an insulated cooler pocket right here. Um, and this is nice. A good size for you. Yeah. Perfect. I mean, it's a good size for me too, but awesome. I will say it doesn't feel as sturdy as this one. Maybe it's because it's lifted higher, um, but that's a good option. And it has this little uh, rubber piece for a headrest. Okay. It seems like it might last a little while, not super durable, but it's still comfortable. So. All right, we're going to move on to the Caribbean Joe, this red one right here. It's a high weight capacity beach chair. And on this one, it has a backpack strap like the Rio does, so that's nice. And then you literally just open it up like that. You want to sit first, babe? Yeah, I'll take a seat. Uh, see, this one for me is, is not as comfortable as a lower back. The headrest is going to the middle of my shoulders. Um, it just has this little cup holder here, no extra bags. There is uh, one small. And you are limited right here, so. There is a small bag back here. It doesn't completely close, it's just Velcroed um, for your little items, but let me take a look. Does it recline at all? It feels sturdy. Yeah, this one reclines, a let's bit. see. How far can you get it? That far. So it doesn't recline like this one. 
um, like the first one, but it's still sturdy. It's a, it's a decent chair. I don't think it's as well made as this one right here. Um, it just feels like I'm sinking down in it a little bit faster. And this cup holder, um, I don't think it could fit a lot of different styles of cups. Whereas this one has a larger round, uh, the, di the diameter is larger. Um, so this one's just okay. And our last one is a Margaritaville beach chair. This one has the straps as well for the backpack. What I like and notice right away is right here, these straps give it support. So when you're sitting down, I don't know if those had it, um, if you're, especially if you're larger or uh, just want more durability, that seems like it would hold up a little bit better. So you undo that. You want to check it out first? For you Margaritaville fans, Jimmy Buffett fans, this might be the chair for you. Jimmy Buffett is not my cup of tea though. Um, so this is a little bit cheaper made, like this one. Uh, it does have a container here. Uh, it's still kind of limited on uh, what type of, if you have a, a larger water bottle, it's not going to fit there. Um, but if you do look around back, it does have a nice little pouch um, there. I think this The is only thing with this one, babe, is... It's not as easy access, which could be good or bad, but you have to unclip it to get to get, get your it. things. But it's a very nice size pocket. So if you want more like uh, safety wise, this would be a good one um, because it has two locks right here. Snapping. I'll say this is more for the aesthetics. So if you like the, the symbol here, Margaritaville, it looks cool. Huh. I thought it would give a little more durability because of those ropes I was talking about, but it doesn't feel that much different. And this one goes back, okay. So the this one only goes back a little bit. Um, but the one that does recline all the way back is the Rio. So I think I like that one the most. Yeah, these two. What do you think? These for first, you? First two for me. I like I like the the two Rios. Okay, so for your your size, babe, you would prefer one of these? Yeah, one of these two for me. Okay. And I'm five four. I'm five four. 135-ish. Really? Hush. Right. Um, and I would say this would be my favorite of the four. Um, and then as far as durability and because it has options with laying it back and the two separate pockets for the cooler and the regular items. I do like this one because of the cup holder, although like you said, it's shallow. I like that the phone pocket is right there. And then you have a side pocket, which is easily accessible as well. And the durability. Mm -hmm. Red one, I would definitely say that one's going to go first of all of them, as far as the quality. And the Margaritaville isn't too bad. I would say that's, that's a reasonable one as well. But all in all, I guess our top picks for someone of my size and your size. Two reels. The high, high beach chair. And the uh, five position lay flat backpack shape. Um, all right, we hope you enjoyed our review. Um, we got these at Bed Bath and Beyond, and you get a, an additional twenty percent off if you have the coupons. Because I always try to save money. Or hush, I knew you were going to say something. Or if you are a college student and you can verify that on their app, you get twenty percent off on all of your purchases minus you know a few explosions but we were able to get them discounted because of that um so hope you enjoyed it if you like what we our review if you could please hit like and subscribe to our channel we've got plenty more that we will be sharing as a family